Hello Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Welcome to your monthly general reading for December 2019. Today we're going to ask the Tarot and the Universe what is coming for you. Before I start, I'd like to thank everyone who have subscribed to my channel. Those of you who have liked, shared, commented. Uh, those of you who've booked a reading with me, thank you so much for choosing me. And for those of you who would like a private reading, please do check my about page. All the information you need is there. And once I hear from you, I will get back to you as soon as possible. You can also get me on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and um, through my email as well. So yeah, Jeremy and I, we're going to start and see. Okay right so tarot and universe please tell us what is coming for gemini sun moon and rising and venus signs for december how is their first position looking currently okay three of pentacles what is crossing or complementing gemini wow the empress so you've got two threes here. Wow. So what's going to be the base for Gemini? Six of Wands. Okay. What's going to be in the recent past for Gemini? Okay, we'll take that one and then we'll put this one aside, okay? So what can be achieved or the action Gemini needs to take? Ace of Wands, okay? So what is coming for Gemini? Okay. Justice. How is Gemini going to feel? Okay. Three of um, ones. So you've got three, three, three. Hmm. What's affecting the environment? For Gemini. Right. The magician. Wow. I'm not surprised. Not surprised at all. With those two, I'm not surprised at all. And that one. Yeah. Okay, what's the hopes and fears for Gemini? Ooh. The sun. Wow, Gemini. Wow. This is your hopes and fears. Mm. So what's going to be the outcome for Gemini? Two of Pentacles. Okay. And the bottom deck is Ten of Wands. Okay. I think I'll just add them here, okay? Right, so Gemini, as we see here, certainly there is um, something you, you are looking to create, okay? And I feel that yes, you want to create something that is really outstanding. Yes. But let's look at your recent past. I feel some of you, okay, 
have been defending someone or some people who have had some, um, how would I say it? I think you've been in a, a more defensive, defending mood for other people. Okay. Yes. Yes. For other people. This could be like most of you are uh, in a, in a career where you advocate for people like you are a solicitor or something like that. Um, because we have this here justice. So, um, some of you, um, have been, and this guy is also Libra. Okay. Libra and Scorpio. So there's some, yeah, there's a degree of air element here. Okay. But I feel this to do with your work. You have been defending some people, some individuals, and or you have held some people through something, and now you are at a point where you have you are defending them. But this is behind you. So we'll see if this connects here. Okay. Yes, I feel this to do with work. And here, this being your foundation. Yes, you want to stand out. You want to shine. You you want to come on top. Of course, everybody wants to come on top when of you know when you're working. You want to be successful, and you are determined to be successful because looking at your um, the the bottom deck, you have been working hard. You have been working hard, and something you want to put an end and then have a brand new starter you want to certainly shine that is how i see it okay so having the the three of pentacles and the empress which is complementing you in this position i think it's really really positive because she's an earth sign she's and this also an earth sign okay so I feel you're trying to create order you want to do something creative you've got a task ahead of you and you you certainly want to succeed you are determined to shine I mean um, but I also feel what you are doing um, it may have something to do with women females something of that nature you want to create something you want to have something that um, involves either maternity something that involves women something that involves children for some of you because this is a woman who's pregnant we've got three people here we've got this woman who's also pregnant here and for some of you also feel like you've got um, starting a family on your mind. Okay. Because we've got another three here. So three is playing a major role in your life this December. Okay. Yes. But I also feel this to do with your career. You are certainly doing something that involves, I feel like it involves women. And you want to create something. Okay. And what you can achieve is you being innovative. Here, you need to take action for you to be able to manifest the things that you, you need to make your dream come true. Okay. I can't help it. I simply can't help it. I feel some of you is to do with family. Some of you is purposely for women. I feel you're doing something because this is Venus. Okay. This is Venus. That is how I'm seeing it. And this is all Earth. Okay. But this is Capricorn. This is Taurus. So this is, this is work. And this is also work energy. It's actually you need to take. And of course, justice is also Venus influenced. So what you are doing 
I feel you are looking for justice or you're looking for something in favor of women, something that has something to do with feminine, children, women, something like that. And you have been fighting for it, okay? You have been fighting for it. And it is coming. Because whether you are defending men or women, okay? Here, as we can see, you are defending the situation. I feel it's a legal situation for some of you. Or it's something that has to be written, you know, in, in terms of law. And this is going to... Whatever you are looking for in terms of justice, justice is coming and the people you are fighting for are going to get what they, they need to get. And also, I feel this is, for some of you, it's a new business venture and you need to have all the legal documentations to get, to get this to work. And it is certainly going to happen. Okay, it is certainly going to happen. Because that's what you want. That is how I feel. And here, this is how you'll be feeling. You have three options. Here. And I feel this is... This is certainly a collaboration of some sort. You know? It's a collaboration of some sort. I cannot help it. It's a collaboration of some sort here. That is when I compare all this together. Yeah. I feel this has something to do with women and children or family. Something like that. Because, you know, this is a pregnant woman. This, is, this could be seen as a couple going to um, other people. But this is a collaboration. This is a collaboration of some sort that is coming in. Because when we take a close look, for some of you, this could be an offer coming in. And I feel it's a, a business um, offer that is coming in for you, that you could be working with someone to come up with this success that you are looking for. Okay, but I feel you've got a lot to choose from looking at everything here. You know, for some of you, you've got two people making you offers. For some of you, you can go your own way. And for some of you, you want to see which one is best for you. And we come to the magician, which is affecting your environment. And still, this is to do with your career. This certainly has something to do with your career. And affecting your environment is having a new start. And of course, looking at the ten of wands is your career. You 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 are at the point where you need to make some choices, make some decision and start something else. But you you are wondering if you want to collaborate with others or you want to go it solo. Okay? That is how I see it here. That is how I feel is your dilemma. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. You know? And this is your hopes and fears. The sun. Shining bright. And I feel having the sun in this position shows that, you know, whatever you are hoping for, it's going to manifest in your own favor okay even though your outcome is the two of pentacles for me i feel like yeah you've got two opportunities either you are going to start your own business yeah or you can go solo okay i feel the new you know this is something that you are doing for you are preparing for 2020. Yes, that is how I, I feel this is. This is all preparing for 2020. So whether you start in December or not, I feel December is a time for you to prepare for your next, let's say your next career. So this could be a career change for you. 
having this 10 here and this one here. Yes. It's a career change. That is how I'm starting to, you know, connect all these things. Because here you are looking at going elsewhere to work on something, you know. So this is how you are. This is a career change for you. Yes, 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 yes. Wow. Yeah, whatever it is, it is your career. And I feel at the end of the month or whichever time it happens, you know, your outcome is choosing to. Whether you choose to work for yourself or work with someone else to create something, you know, it's totally up to you, totally your choice. And you have every right, okay? You have every right to choose whatever you want to choose. Because this is your hopes and fears. And being your hopes and fears, I feel this is yes. Whatever you want, you are going to get. You're going to shine. And so, yes, Gemini, this is this has been really good. I hope this has been insightful for you. And um, if you want a private reading, please do contact me. And then I'll get back to you as soon as possible. And then I want to wish you a happy Christmas in advance. I will see you next time or you will see me next time.